Hey guys, Kay here. Welcome to episode one of Thea the Awakening. Uh, super excited to switch things up a little bit. Um, I know I've kind of played Humankind and Civ in this in this slot for uh, pretty much the... Uh, no, I did try Reyes too. But anyway, uh, yeah, I was just kind of um, thought I'd throw out a poll and I'm kind of excited this one. So let's get started. So I'm Quick thing, I'm totally new to the game, so I've had a couple of suggestions, but that is about it. I have never played it before. I was told to do this. Ooh, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> Not godlike. unlock them. Okay, let me see. Um, I, I kind of want to play as Zarog. They research faster. I do like that. I don't know. We're going to give this guy a try, I think. Thea is awakened. Welcome. No time to waste. You are a deity of the High Pantheon, and you must help your worshippers survive the darkness. So what now, you ask? You are divine, yes, but you have little power, and so you will know the world through your people's eyes. This means sometimes you will encounter your own divine messengers, and maybe even face your own avatars. Weird, I know. Your first mission is to survive. Every critter is trying to make sure you stay down. So get food and craft better equipment to protect yourselves. You will guide your people to victory, either by sheer survival and progress, or by solving the Cosmic Tree's mystery. Um, yeah, well, I don't really want to skip the tutorial, honestly. But a messenger, Theodore, you can call me. But let us focus on you. Thea is a broken land. The underworld is shut, and the undead roam the earth. And creatures of darkness that ruled for a century want you dead. First, go and explore your village. Check the inventory to see your stocks, and send people to gather food and fuel, like wood. Without food, people will starve. And without fuel, they will not craft or even heal, so these are really important. Food and fuel. Yes. Once you've visited your village, check out the people standing outside. The exploring party. Select your party and send them to me. I will wait for your people outside the village. Wow. I have marked your people's map with a big blue question mark so they will see where I am. Oh, and if you ever forget what your current task is, just check out your logbook. The logbook. No. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, so let's learn this together. Yep, love like that. It's easy. Okay, I like it. I don't like how this looks. Okay, and is this what they're okay good at? It looks like maybe. Uh, 
fight. Oh, okay, 12 turns, 3 turns. Once the task is completed, you will receive the resource pack. Was told to check that off. Ah, and you can do expeditions. Dang, there's like a whole crafting system. Oh, I see, you have to do, gotcha. Can I? Hmm. Oh, maybe this means he was good at, uh, I don't know, I guess we can put some stuff. Could split them. So these are my Well, let's look at, how do I look at the tasks again?
we because we're not using all of our folks I don't think what do you need for resources oh, okay yeah you're not doing anything hmm Oh, this is where we just were. Oh, I think I was supposed to bring them. Did we just get anything? welcomes you. Well, hello there. I see you're finding your feet and making first steps into the world. Well done. Five options unavailable. Events such as meeting me will occur throughout your adventures. Sometimes they are random, sometimes predestined, and always varied. Events can occur. Many events will ask you to bring stuff or do things in order to move to the next stage. I asked you before to gather food and fuel in your village. So you can gather resources in your village, but also by setting up a camp when you're out exploring. Good. Okay. Now events can lead to conversations or just random disasters, but they can also lead to challenges. To show you what I mean, dreams. He is seen coming always from the same direction and returning there after several hours of haunting. Your people awake uneasy every night and some become cursed. Your scouts soon mark a possible location of the ghost's home. Well, that's incredibly freaky. So, can I, like... You find the boars Theodore told you about. There is only a couple, so it should not be too hard. However, instead of a straight fight, you can try to do a proper hunt. If you have the right skills, that is. Or better yet, you can go all native on these beasties and wrestle them to the ground. Not an easy option, that one. Any 
Great. You have the right skill, in this case gathering, to enter into an alternate challenge. In non-fight challenges, mm. the wounds you get during the challenge... Maybe that's why it had like a little, like one skull compared to the two. I just want to see what this looks like. Okay. Need to eliminate all the cards, okay. Okay, I see that. mistake put my weakest one out there okay so I can put these cards out. Okay, this one's the toughie. Okay. So then, okay, she got taken out.
between am I crazy? I don't really see their the, their defense going down. I just see me. Well, I guess theirs is down by one. It's odd to me. It's because she doesn't have... Oh, is that what that means? Oh my gosh. What am I doing? Hmm, that's a... Uh... They have two. But why do you not do any damage? I think we're gonna have to surrender. She doesn't do any damage either. All right, I got confused on it, but we're good. to say. Damn. You spooked the boars and they run off. No worries, though. You can try again. Yeah, I think... I don't know. I definitely lost some folks. I don't know. She's right... Okay. You know what? Maybe it's because they didn't have any hunting. I don't know. Right? Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Um. Yeah, I do get confused about that. What happens when we go, you know what I mean? Like, is there something I can pick up there? You stumble across some ruins oh, of an old city, cool. engulfed in mist and mystery. You open one of the buildings, a strange looking stone and metal built affair, and you hear a clunking noise, then a blunt thud. Before you are able to do anything, you see a skeleton charging your way. Alright, let's try this one more time. Okay, now we've got some good, uh... Twelve? <gasps> Ooh, I don't know about that. Okay. 
Okay. Hulking rat. Gross. Yeah, this is much better. It must have been because I didn't have the skills for it. I don't. I guess. I don't know. You search the buildings and discover a supply store still intact. Oh, beautiful. Okay, how do... Right, we got the enemies. Still got some turns left. Or do they keep, like... I don't know. Oh. Maybe they just keep doing it. I don't know. I feel like we need someone to cook some food, you know? Minced meatballs. Oops. See, the thing is, is I actually should probably... Like, what do I, what do, I do with this child? Okay. Plus one MP. Movement point, I think. Hmm, I think we're probably good. back out there, right? I 
I guess we can do auto resolve occasionally, but it's kind of fun to uh, to do some of this too. Automatic cards. Dismantle. Hmm. Ah, we want to go down here too. We need to figure out what to do with these boars as well. You find the boars Theodore told you about. There is only a couple, so it should not be too hard. However, instead of a straight fight, you can try. I think I'm gonna do this. Oh yeah, that's that's gonna go a bit better, I think. I was trying to get him out actually, but ah, uh, wow, they hit kind of hard, don't they? Shield bonus. That's no bueno. Ah, oh, these guys hurt a little, don't they? a lot actually okay you have slaughtered the boars, and you are able to salvage much usable stuff from them. The downside to choosing combat is that your people Ooh. may get wounds, and with heavy wounds they will risk death every turn until they heal once more. So that would be time to set up camp, I think. Got a lot of stuff though.
Yeah, we need to get them. One of your people has a particular talent for teaching. Kids and adults alike find it easy to learn from them. One of your people becomes more skilled at speech. Oh, I guess we didn't need to do that, did we? I just wanted to see. Because, you know, it's funny is the thing's right there, you know? So let's just go back to the village, right? Will they heal here? Hmm. We'll have to see. we got some other stuff to start with at the beginning of the next one. So far, I am a fan. Um... I didn't even see this. Alright. Yeah, it's just gonna take some time getting used to, but I'm I'm a fan so far. I really like it. So anyway, we will see y'all for the next one. Thanks for watching.